there's a job training program that's all about bringing technical education to where the workers are, and that's especially important for those in the manufacturing sector. Now, thanks to a $3 million grant from the federal government, Hennepin Technical College has more resources to help manufacturing workers expand their skills and create opportunities to put other people to work. Delane Cleveland explains. This is a, a big day for us. Educational opportunities at Hennepin Technical College can take on many forms. Particularly in the areas of machining, welding, um, automated controls. Friday, dozens gather to celebrate the college's latest innovation. Without further ado, I guess I'll snap the ribbon here. A virtual manufacturing lab. Come on in. The whole idea with this lab is to uh, increase availability to manufacturing education. Oh, that's great. Hey. <laughs> the lab features hands-on simulation technology for students to do things such as virtual welding. I went right across, and this time I was almost straight. And virtual manufacturing. We're just adding to our arsenal um, with this, this simulator-based equipment. Hennepin Tech has plans to open similar training centers in other parts of the Twin Cities. That'll make it easier for students so they don't have to travel all the way up to Brooklyn Park. I want to deliver something that the, that the consumer wants, consumer being the student. That's especially important for employers such as the Toro Company in Shakopee. The technology changes all the time. Doug Miller says many Toro employees have to constantly brush up on their skills. All of our employees virtually have to travel up here and if they can create this virtual lab for us down there, then we can get those needs fulfilled at that South Metro Eden Prairie campus. Meantime, the virtual lab is designed to help anyone. They're returning vets, they're currently employed, they're unemployed. With an interest in manufacturing. Having people employed, doing a job they love, benefits everybody. In Brooklyn Park, Delane Cleveland, 12 News. The sites currently under consideration for virtual manufacturing labs include Eden Prairie, Buffalo, and North Minneapolis.